So we're finally here. A lot of people have asked me about the schedule timer on a Mitsubishi Eco Dan unit. And it's been about six months since I did the first video on just simply setting the hot water temperatures. Seems like a lot of people need a lot of help. So we'll go through setting the schedule timer today. So if we go into the engineer setting here, press that button there and scroll across to schedule timer and then just press the tick button again we've got option for heating and we've got an option for hot water now setting the schedule timer is the same principle for both of these options okay but for today we're going to do it on the heating so if we press the tick button we've got an option here so we've got monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday this black line here is basically saying that this is programmed for timed all day every day okay now to change this press the notepad button now we've got the option to change the days now if you're slightly weird and like to have your heating or hot water time set for different days what you can do is, is you can press this button here and then scroll across to the next one and you can choose which days you want to change okay but for these purposes we're going to run every single day exactly the same okay so if we press the tip button on that one it will now bring a little dial here a little arrow pointing down with a play button okay now to change the time simply press the tick button and scroll across and delete the black marker where you don't want heating or hot water okay so for example we want heating to come on at six o'clock in the morning okay we'll press the tick button there and then we want it to end at yeah, nine o'clock in the morning we'll press the tick button there and we'll get rid of the afternoon okay and for example, we want the heating to come on again for when we get home from work. So we'll start it at four o'clock. Okay, and you can see the time here when it's saying that you're now starting it. So if you watch that, this will change as I push this button. So we'll start that again at four o'clock. Press the tick button there. Scroll across to when we want it to end. So say heating all the way through until 10 p.m. for example. Press the tick button. Get rid of the remaining black marker. And press the tick button to confirm. And once you've set your times there, just press the little save button here. And it will say confirmed. And that is how you program your timer. When you come out of the main screen, pressing the return button all the way back to the menu. If you are wanting to run your heating on hot water on a timer, just make sure you press this button here and make sure that you change either or to timed, okay? So this means permanently on, this means permanently off, and this means timed. And it's the same for this one here. Ignore that touch panel and ignore the energy monitoring. You just want to focus on the hot water and the heating. Hope that helps. 